Hello rack complaints desk. Maramu bakateka muntaito. Kandi sente nkukogambele ngufezi yoku marira bazimazi. Yes. Kale, hati uwebale munu ensonga yawe, ntuija, ntuija kugihondereza. In a quarter, we look at around 300 cases from the eight districts where we work. Actually, there are now nine. The nine districts cover Kabarore, Kasese, Kamwenge, Chenjojo, Ntoroko, Bundibujo, Bunyangabu, Chegegwa, and now the new district of Kitagwenda. This is where Renzori Anti-Corruption Coalition, popularly referred to as RAC, a citizen-led anti-corruption coalition, has been combating corruption for the past 18 years. RAC was founded in 2002. It was an organization called Kabarole Research and Resource Center, which organized a meeting with various leaders, and they decided to rank what were the, com the issues in the region which they could address as a community. So corruption came up as number two, and the they decided to fight corruption in the region, so they set up committees at sub-county level. These were voluntary committees. RAC has never looked back. The thoroughness, commitment, and courage with which the organization operates has won it people's confidence, respect, and trust, becoming a formidable force to reckon with in as far as combating corruption, promoting community welfare, and service delivery is concerned. Here we meet Francis Akiki, oh, a five-year-old with a heartbreaking story surrounding his birth. It sheds some light on why people in Renzori region are attached to RAC. So that is also our challenge. When we intervene, the patient may automatically die in that gap of time. In fact, the family of this lady was so bitter when they started receiving calls from their family. Health is one of the critical sectors that RAC attaches high priority. As a citizen-led initiative, empowering communities forms the basis of their operations. With about 10 full-time staffs, RAC would not be able to cover the region with the kind of spread and efficiency it enjoys. Monitors and activists, we have a total of 630, and these are spread across the eight districts where we work, although there are right now nine because of Chittagwenda. It is this team that RAC empowers to expose and cause action against corruption in their communities. This has enabled the organization to tackle corruption head on, bottom up. This road is in Nyauka Town Council, in the Vujo district. So when we came to monitor it, we, uh, we, we found being a soldier work, Karamagi was, uh, as an engineer, was like. Uh, Overlooking me, he wrote a report to the executive director of the Anti-Corruption Coalition, one of Yangwa Angela. She had also to take a concern and called the, the Minister of Ethics and Integrity. Working with the Director of Ethics and Integrity and uh, 
interagency forum, that is IGG, Auditor General, PPDA, DPP, all those people. It has helped us really to cap down on the number of cases we've been receiving for threats. Because now people are like, oh, these people are protected by government, so we are not being threatened as we used to be. We have the law which protects the fighters against corruption. We make sure that they are safe in the first place, and if when in the worst of things, they have to be hidden. We even have to uh, expatriate them, even as far as defacing somebody. The Minister of Ethics and Integrity decided to arrest the Kirak and the engineer and all the team which were involved in smuggling this, this man of the road. It's like a tribunal, they can arrest, they can, uh, they can they can take action there and then. When the, when the cracker was built out, he came and redid the road on his own cost. So you can see it as a success Iraq is doing in the community. It is these kinds of achievements that keep the rock monitors going regardless of associated risks. <laughs> Be it as it may that combating corruption has brought them some enemies, their contribution is not entirely lost to the communities. Sangana Sukuro Abusaru, Ariyoki Zebukia sitting accommodation, Pana Banjava Stamaganse, Baburu and Teve, Kuro, Perena, Ana, Runana, Nenka, Verebu Kaika, Twa Kisering on the Master. Tuasaramutuasaramutuasangasanganana receiving so we wrote to the DO notifying what what happened the headmaster decided to to, to to use his own money to have the 25 which which was missing put on the school he also added four instead of 25 he brought 29. Beyond monitoring abuses, the RAC monitors are critical in lobbying for effective social service delivery. leadership <laughs> We go to Choho 2 village, where the RAC team wants to check the progress of Choho Bridge. Choho Bridge, which connects Nyanga to Kasese, is an important bridge, mainly a farming community. This bridge connects them to the markets in Kasese. It is also here that they are able to access Chibito and Chibinero Health Center. Children also go to school on the other side of the market. Construction of this bridge started three years ago but it has since not been constructed. Yes. Route is sad. Out of Ramova, Sama Tuk. Vama is a sand, is a vacuum. Vama, Vama end. Hama Savant, no Vama end. Pass at the robotics. Ababukolia. With the delayed completion of the bridge, the community had to improvise, but at a great risk. Katran Zero Wahoo to a Sokako. A hobo called you a warrant. Concerned community members contacted RAC and as always RAC did not disappoint. Immediately RAC engaged the district which had already conducted an internal audit. It is the district report that RAC premised its intervention to ensure that the community and government does not lose out. One of the projects we are, we are going to share today is the progress that has been undertaken on the Choho Bridge. We advertised the, the bridge, Choho Bridge, we got three bidders, go two bidders, and the Robtex, Miss Robtex has the process with a successful bidder at 477 million, and is the one working on the, the bridge now. Mm. 
And so far, what the worker is doing, is doing a very good work. After the, the bridge is soon completion. Tukala nge kano ya tutebaka tuteba, ambu engineer district siyata mutu. We have actually created challenges the people are facing in those uh, neighboring communities and even beyond. So we also wanted that bridge to be completed. They, they pay work done. What has been what done. Has been done. Mm -hmm. Therefore, whatever has been done has been paid. Yes. Interestingly, even when district officials is part of who RAC monitors, the various districts in the region seems to have struck an alliance to the extent of introducing a joint forum where they meet and review performance of the various sectors. I have people from Rock, and there is a building that uh, was supposed to be renovated. I think it should have been even condemned. So are you aware of the contract and the details of this uh, of this building? This is the town meeting? Uh, she's the one. Ah, Oliver, are you still alive? I know you are new here, yes. but you have the details. I found when they are given 5.4, the contractor. And so I on top of 5.4 you added 5.4 added 2. Yeah. Mm. So uh, when he was given the 5.4 million, what had he exactly done with that they money? He told me that he only put the timber. The they have the contract. The, the, con con the contract. The contract sum, the bills of counties, yes, the the agreement. Yes, we have. Mm. But uh, the the treasurer has gone to to Bundibuju police station. They have called him with all the documents. So concerning this building, no everything. But we can still get those documents at a later stage. The following week, the joint monitoring group came back, this time with more stakeholders, and in the process, two people, including the engineer and former town clerk, were arrested. RAC brings a collective, uh, we call it a, a collective voice of civil society organizations, but also citizens at the grassroots level. This collective voice, once it is strong, then we can be able to, it can be able to fleet at the national level. This also helps eliminate gaps that provide fertile ground for corruption, where culprits take advantage of the disconnection between national administration and grassroots to exploit peasants, such as was the case in Toroko. Mbamanya ngobara tunigiriza nun tugarukira. Beito ntusi maraka munu haboko tu watungiro kunigirizibwa. Raka e kamaliira e tukwasira hamkono. Government of Uganda embarked on plans to take running water to Ntoroko district. Chavadara village was identified as a suitable location. And as such, owners of the land where the project had been developed were contacted Necessary valuations were undertaken, a total of 580 million according to available documents that we have seen was dispatched, except the affected persons did not get the actual amounts. Permanent secretary, sentence ya say ni ingire, okuija kukompaseti ingi ito avantu. Mirioni vitano ne kinana nzinu ziri na hanu. Hanyuma batu oleka senti, banyoleka nkanyo kalimu kagamba banyoleke mirioni makumi yago, atanu. Batere simu buli muntu wa mtelire senteze nka account kugenda account na sanga batire milioni 10 nezo na isatu eki kikatuhambiriza kuiruka muraka kugenda kugama ngo bandu watu iba ntukoraki ni turora rack immediately took up the matter with the urgency and seriousness it deserved before rack we, we i got 3 m then after rack interviewed they, just, they added 1.5 Bakaba mpaire e milioni itano ni mtuwaru makumi ya inga. Asoto. Beito vuna irukire na genda mkitongole chiaraka. Kandi na yongerua ezi indi sentezi kuinga na milioni makumi ya aviri na isato. Rock has been even more impactful in the past two years. We've had a lot of corruption reduction. Why? Every quarter we are in the district. Thanks to support from the Democratic Governance Facility and a RENLAP 2 project. The project seeks to strengthen RAC's engagement with the government and relevant stakeholders, which has served to realize better planning, budgeting, and monitoring of government projects, as well as more community engagements. And even we've had a lot of prevention. 
measures. Eh? Usually, last time, we used to, like long ago, we used to have post-mortem. Where you would go to a bridge, maybe after a year, you find it collapsed, then you're like complaining, so and so did it. But these days, even before it happens, we're already there. So we are doing more preventive, and that is for me an achievement. <laughs>